Sisters and brethren, I trust I find you all safe and well in these difficult and challenging times. Then I take this opportunity to thank you all personally for your efforts during the past number of weeks as we have gone through this challenging and difficult situation. Private level, personal level and at district level in the way you have stepped up to the challenge in providing PPE, sanitizer and food to the community. Showing that this institution has always had the community at heart. I would now ask you if you could continue that work in our County Just Giving page, which was set up a number of weeks ago. I would ask you if you would please give generously to the target or indeed help us to exceed it so that we in the weeks coming ahead as this virus continues that we would be in a position as a county to help and support within the community. Your generosity in the past is, is unquestionable and indeed I would just suggest that this year we're going to have no formal 12th of July parades or assemblies. Each 12th of July I'm sure You've went to the field, you've enjoyed, bought a cup of tea, a burger, you've had the children and you've bought them something on the day. It's a day which we all cherish, it's a day which we all enjoy. Could I ask you now that maybe that small contribution that you pay, you'll make on the 12th, you would now make to the county down, just giving pains and time. Keep him and the mm-hmm. and Brian and their families who have lost loved ones during this episode. Let us pray that they will know who and what is supporting them and this institution should be at the forefront of it. I do wish that you all remain safe and well. I would ask you to stay at home. Thank you for your generosity in advance and God bless you all. Goodbye.